Becoming fit for glory. The Lord will give grace and glory. Psalm 84 verse 11. Grace is what we need just now, and it is to be had freely. What can be freer than a gift? Today we shall receive sustaining, strengthening, sanctifying, satisfying grace. He has given daily grace until now, and as for the future, that grace is still sufficient. If we have but little grace the fault most lie in ourselves, for the Lord is not straitened, neither is he slow to bestow it in abundance. We may ask for as much as we will, and never fear a refusal. He giveth liberally and upbraideth not. The Lord may not give gold, but he will give grace. He may not give gain, but he will give grace. He will certainly send us trial, but he will give grace in proportion thereto. We may be called to labor and to suffer, but with the call there will come all the grace required. What an end is that in the text, and glory. We do not need glory yet, and we are not yet fit for it, but we shall have it in due order. After we have eaten the bread of grace, we shall drink the wine of glory. We must go through the holy, which is grace, to the holiest of all, which is glory. These words and glory are enough to make a man dance for joy. A little while, a little while, and then glory forever.